Cyber okay, that's going to be 1-1. One, one. Evos and Cyber as we get straight into game number one. Cyber X takes on Evos Legends here in match four. Rexy on that Eudora like predict like as as predicted. And now I will give my predictions. I will okay. be the tiebreaker. I love the underdogs and I will have to side with Cyber X for this game. And LJ already being a nuisance here, especially against the Claude. This is what you're supposed to do. This is you cannot let him farm properly. Already dealing damage to both members, but he has to be careful because no can no can take. Oh. Out that. We got the news. We are back to the game, and it will be 0 0. Jarhead was able to run away from that one, but Claude has been um, able to farm properly, actually. He has a one level lead onto yep. Parasic right now, and that is not good. Nya has to be very, very careful with his farming, though, because LJ in the early game is insane. And oh, Clover already winning the lane. Wow. Like crazy here. He's be, he's able to Two chunk people take calling. Yeah. But Two look at that calling. mid lane, guys. Like, Eudora is kind of just chunking yeah. these down. With her burst, kind You're of right. amazing. I mean, both player, both teams are quite playing quite aggressively. So this mm -hmm. is quite cool. And as you can see, and the bottom lane here, Fersic is just trying to help out, uh, trying to pressure the bottom lane as well. As they know, Clover is kind of behind. Yeah, but look at that. That's another being used. Rexy gonna wow. flicker in. The burst comes in, and Nya's gonna get taken down. No, Fersic caught in the bad situation, but is able to run away. LJ will be traded back by the team of Cyber X, as that will be a one for one. But the Lunox will be able to push that wave to the turret. A turn. See, that's the thing about Eudora. She's, the, the, the cool thing about Eudora is that you can just flicker in, point and click stun, and you can kind of shut down anyone that you want, guys. Yeah, for sure. 100% here. Evo's Legends. Um, it looks like they have actually swapped the lanes here. Yep. Cy Cyber X wanted to swap, but instant response from Evo's Legends. Yeah. Lunas will go to the top side to face that Chang'e. Again, these are very natural counters to each other. And right now, because of the crazy swaps that they've mm -hmm. been doing, Evo's Legends has actually gotten the better position here in the first turtle. A turtle. Yeah, here you can see Fursic already chunking down that turtle. But Riley here already on standby, you know, maybe to make some Whoa, damage wait. here, but no, what happened guys? there? Eve got taken down. That was a solo kill by Rexy. My goodness, this is the power of Eudora that exactly. I mentioned earlier. That the burst. early game pressure, and this is why I really love the uh, Eudora pick coming in from Evo's Legends, although I'm siding with Cyber X overall, because I really like that Akai pick that came in last second. Evo's Legends, they certainly do have the early game, so Cyber, they need to wait and prolong the game, but even if they do, Evo still has a lot of, in a lot of uh, insurance here for the late game. They got the Alice and the Lunox from both of the side lanes, a turn. Yeah, that's true. I mean, as you can see here, Jawhead and Eudora, they're quite a scary duel here. Ooh. But look, as you can see, yeah. here goes. Look at that already, LJ trying to do damage, and look at that. Everyone just get bursted down right here. Fairsick looking for more. The Flicker will ensure Tit's safety, but Anti-Mage now going on to TNTK. Clover's right there to support him, and it will be a kill picked up by Anti-Mage, a four for zero trade. This is not what they want to look for, and that is going to be the turret goal all picked up for the side of Fairsick. Gets straight into the game right here. LJ gets taken a little bit. Oh, he actually gets a kill, and wow. what was that? He was able to outplay him with the help of Rexy, even though he was one bar, Ghani. Wow. Can <laughs> then Rachel, any thoughts here? But guys, you know, you keep saying how Evos is really, really strong in the early game and everything, but we I mean, it's still four minutes in, we don't know where this is coming from, and we haven't seen any crazy plays by Cyber oh, X, but guys, look at Antimage as he goes in for Tit. Will no. he escape? But oh, he gets Yo, shut down by Yeve, guys. Yeah. I think he was a little bit offside there. That was a very offside by Antimage, something that, I mean, he is known to do, but usually he survives those kind of plays, but unfortunately, Cyber X will be able to punish him with the rotation from Yiv from the mid side. And yeah, I mean, at least it was traded back. He didn't get it for free. LJ now goes in, the Claude will be chunked down, and oh. that is all she wrote. That is going to be a one-shot from Rexy as Fersic will contest. This purple buff goes in onto Riley, take it very low. The purple buff will go uncontested for Fersic as he still has that retribution to secure it. The mid side has been pushed by Clover as well. They're pressuring every single wave, every single lane right here, order of chaos to be used by Clover. Flickers away from the real world manipulation, and that is going to be a very, very easy trade for Evo's Legends they turn. Yeah, you're completely right. But here, as you can see, five minutes in, and the turtle Sky Razor is already up, guys. And it seems like Cyber X is already trying to pressure that top lane so they can prepare for that turtle. But as you can see here, Evos is already going in, and oh, oh and my then Mega God. Kill. Yeah, Bye Mega Dora. Kill picked up. They're gonna go for Riley right now. Anti Mage joins in the fight. The Immobilize comes in on the TNTK. The damage is just there. He gets taken down by Rexy. Ooh. A double kill as LJ is gonna be able to juke everyone away, and that is gonna be another kill. No, Flickers in, but no kill. Rexy. What what are you doing? Oh! That's gonna be a shutdown picked up by <laughs> Nart. Oh my god, and that 
What was Rexy doing? It looks like there's um, some kind of... There was That was hesitation right there. But Anti-Mage, it looks like he wants to go in. First he goes in as well. Riley's going to be taken down. Nard still has a split split to run away. But another kill picked up for nothing by Evo's Legends. And look at that. Clover is waiting in that bush. Waiting for the jungler uh -oh. to come back right now. And Yao will be able to join the fight. That's all for being used to Nard. Clover from the oh, back God. side. Yao will be able to get a kill. But look at Fairsing. He's there on TNTK. Yao's going to be taken down by Fairsing. But Clover's running away. Nard trying to make the most out of this. But they will just trade the turret for that kill, Johnny. How, wow, wow, what an action-packed early game, guys. Mirko, Rachel, action left and right, top to bottom, and, but Yo is sitting at a 0-4-2 stat, guys. This is not looking good for Claude. He is struggling at farming, and of course, as a Claude player, you want that DHS fast, you want that golden uh, stat fast, give more impact for your team. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I guess he's just trying his the, as best as he can to kind of avoid uh, any... Oh, but a Meteor Shower has been popped and Riley goes in for first sec and he goes in with his Hurricane. Oh, but he goes down yeah, by he goes Zora. Down. He got melted there. He was a tank and he got melted. Nart is the next target. LJ has used the smart missiles, but Nart flickers in the front. Stun comes in and Nart will be bursted down by Clover. I think Cyber X, again, they're just committing way too much to these team fights. They have to play the trades because if not, Evo's Legends, they're just going to take every single team fight, take every single objective, mm -hmm. and control the game from here. It is already, Gani, a 6 Thousand gold lead for the side of Evo's Legends, Eterna. Yeah, I mean, did you see another oh. tower went down? Oh, and he goes back in, and Tanti gets really low, Ooh. and he has, gets down, and uh, Meteor Shower goes in, but none can be taken down by the Meteor Shower. But an Alice here on Anti Mage, all yeah. going in very deep, and he now has to go down. Beautiful plays from Evo's Legends. Cyber X caught off guard and instantly. The second you make a mistake against Evo's Legends, they will capitalize on that as Evo's wow. are taking this game 15 to 4, 7 minutes in. Anti Mage Rickers inside. That's the two man immobilized as he will be able to buy time Ooh. for his teammates. Inhibitor Tower has been taken down in the mid side. Meteor Shower to secure that minion wave, but no, it does not do any damage. Real world manipulation has been popped, but they will be able to run away. Riley now goes in with the. Oh, oh my, my God, God, it doesn't even matter. That is going to be a schmurder thing. <laughs> Insane plays by Evo's Legends Eterna. Guys, 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 I mean, this is going really, really badly for Cyber X. They're getting punished from every single lane here. And as you can see, a lot of them try to overcommit, trying to make plays, but first six. He's just really good at his positioning and he can't get caught. Yeah, this is, again, one of the mistakes that Evo's Legends has been making back in the regular season. Fair six positioning. That is one of the mistakes that they haven't been able to find out back in the MPL. But now it looks like Fair Six is playing a very perfect game against Cyber X. And yesterday also against Sodok, LJ opens up the map. They're going to engage the LJ. But again, that is not the right target. Nart forced to use that split split. It is on a very low cooldown, so he's still going to be able to run away. Anti Mage goes in against two members. He's going to be able to take down TNTK. No, he won't. The Flicker will ensure safety as LJ zones everyone away. Nart will oh. be taken down. Killing free secured by Clover. Guys, I don't know what to say at this stage. I mean, Gani, what are the winning conditions here by Cy for Cyber X? Oh, oh my what? god, no, that is not the right play. The snipe oh from downtown. My oh my god. Ferrisic gets a kill. Evo's Legends pushing the pace. Almost a 10,000 goal lead here in the ninth minute. They're looking to end the game as fast as possible, Eterna. This is a complete disaster from Cyber X as they all just keep on getting baited to these fights and they're committing way too much. And I think they're getting, they're quite panicking. I mean, oh, look at Cologne, he just goes in yeah. and zones everyone. No hesitation whatsoever as they take down the tier two turret in the top side, inhibitor turret in the mid side, and also the bottom lane has been taken down. Cyber X A on full defensive mode right now and they have nothing they can do right now because the pressure are the pressure is all in their base, right? They have lost two inhibitor turrets, there's only one turret standing, and they haven't gotten a single turret or objective this game, Eterna. I mean, yeah, you're, you're right, it's a complete disaster. As you can see, all three lanes were pushed, and they immediately responded EVOS, knowing that maybe they couldn't go in. Uh, I think they're cho choosing to use a more safe play by securing this Lord right now, and obviously it will go uncontested wow. for EVOS, and I guess they just need to wait it out. Yeah, again, it is just, there's nothing Cyber X can do. They can't even open the map because they need to defend their base. And they know that if Anti-Mage goes in, he's able to 1v3 Garnet. <laughs> exactly, but right now, Evos, uh, with their with this lead, almost 10k gold, and with the first Lord, even, even though it is not enhanced, I, I think there's a, there's a big 
huge possibility that they could end the game right here, right now. Huge possibility right here. Oh my oh god, this is gonna go in. Riley goes in with the Hurricane Dance, but it's not gonna be enough. Unstoppable picked up. Oh. Clover will be traded back. Nart will be able to get that shutdown, but look at the backside. Anti Mage just deletes him. A double kill picked up by Fairsick. Going for a triple kill, but no. The killing speed will be secured by Rexy. But no, nope. triple kill for Fairsick. They're gonna go for the Maniac. No, they're gonna go for the end. They're gonna dive though, and Maniac picked wow. up for Fairsick right guys, here as they guys, secure. Guys.